Alan. 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 Uh, it's Frank Maloney. We've got a room full of press guys here and they want to know why Stephen's not coming over on the 23rd of July. Sorry, uh, go ahead Frank, we we'll just put you on the speaker. Okay, I'm just saying we've got a room full of press guys, a room full of fighters who were looking forward to fighting on the undercard of a world championship. They just wanted to know why young Steve's not here on the 23rd of July and it's been moved to September the 11th. Well, I'll speak to that. Uh, Steve suffered, uh, suffered a stress fracture of the, of the shin. We thought originally it was a splint, but we went in, we had an MRI, and he was in the middle of training. And uh, obviously with the stress fracture, the doctor uh, told us we couldn't fight and we needed six weeks healing time, and uh, that's we rescheduled the fight for September with your good self. So, anyone got any questions for Steve? Or um, is Steve disappointed about this? Uh, are you obviously looking forward to this defense over here? Yeah, I'm very disappointed. Like, like Alan said, I was already in training, you know, we already had sparring lined up, and um, things were looking good for July 23rd, and you know, mentally I was ready, physically I was getting there, and this happened, so you know, I was, I was very disappointed with the injury. Are you confident you'll be over the injury in time for the next day? You're not going to drop us in it again? No, I'm, I'm, I'm confident I'll be over. I've been taking, I've been listening to the doctor, um, resting the leg, and uh, I'll be confident and I'll be ready at September 11th. What pressure does it bring you fighting uh, away from away from home and uh, defending your, your title over here? I'm not going to bring any pressure, you know. It brings, uh, it brings the best out of Steve Moore, like I proved it my, uh, in my three previous trips over to England, that, you know, when the crowd's against me, everyone's against me, you know, and I'm back into a corner, the best Steve Muller comes out. Thanks, thanks, Steve. And um, you've fought before in the North East, Steve, what sort of atmosphere are you expecting when you get over here? What you, you said you've fought before in the North East, what sort of atmosphere are you expecting? Oh, very hostile, very energetic, uh, electric atmosphere, you know what I mean? Yeah. The UK fans are great, you know, they, they really stand behind their hometown guys, you know, I'm looking for a great atmosphere to, to fight in. What do you know about Jason Booth? Um, he's a good boxer, you know, I, I remember back in the day when I fought his brother, he's a very good technical boxer, better than Nicky Booth, I believe. Um, smaller guy, and you know, we're going to have a great fight come September. Steve, was there any uh, calls for the injury? Did, was there anything that one specific incident that brought the injury on? Oh, this constant, you know, I, you know, like I said, training here, you know, we train the hardest over here with Chris Johnson. And this constant training, you know, I started running outside because the weather became nice. Uh, and it must have started a small crack, you know, and we just kept working on it. I didn't take a break, a break when I felt the pain and it made things worse. Okay, any other questions? All right, thanks, Steve. Thanks, Alan. And you are, they both come over for a press conference before the fight. So it's, um, and Steve will be, is it 10 days you're coming in before the fight and going to come to Sunderland and prepare? Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay, all right, thanks, Steve. Okay, thanks, Alan. Speak to you later. Bye. Bye bye.